Hello everybody, it's Sephiroth Level 4 for another episode of Final Fantasy X HD Postgame. In the last episode, we defeated both Dark Velifor and Dark Ifrit, and today we're going to try to take on Dark Ixion. Uh, now we got the Heat Lance for <laughs> Kimari, which just has Fire Strike. Good. <laughs> Again, I don't really care about the weapons that we're getting from, uh, from the guys here, but yeah. We're back. We're back in Thunder Plains. The yeah, accursed, accursed Thunder Plains. But we did this already. We got we got what we needed. And now there's a person here to talk to. Hello. Hello, good person. How are you today? You heathen! Oh. What just because I'm having a pumpkin spice latte in November? Something up there? Let's go. Pretty sure they were just repeating voice lines from other parts of the game. Why were we chasing that guy? Also, how come we don't get to summon Dark Aeons? That's not fair. Yeah, Dark Ixion comes out of uh, out of the lightning, and that's cool. For boss time. Now, Dark Ixion is an interesting enemy. Uh, you can actually run from this, which is cool. It has an attack. Uh, called Thundaja, which we don't get, it's not fair, that can do max damage. And since it has an attack that attacks one character and does max damage, you know what you could do with Dark Ixion? You can AP grind! You just stick on your stuff that you used for Don Tonberry and get killed by him instead! It's very interesting, actually. Uh, you can steal stamina tablets if you really want to. It has 1.2 million health, overkill of 99999. Drops uh, weapons with lightning strike or break damage limit. Armor with a uh, lightning eater or break HP limit or ribbon. And also drops uh, dark matter or master sphere. Um, the uh, ex dark Ixion over here, when you attack it, counterattacks. Luckily we have high evasion, which is great. Um, Ixion is the only of the Dark Aeons, I think, that you can just avoid. <laughs> uh, if your evasion is high enough, which is hilarious, actually. <laughs> I feel very bad for him. Um, it, if it uses Aerospark, that does a super dispel, which, like, I called Super Dispel. It gets rid of all of your everything, including auto life if you have it on. That's gonna hurt. Ha! <laughs> Alright, so since we're pretty high in the game and have kind of a high magic stat, that's not doing 9 that 99,999 damage. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. So this fight I'm this fight's kinda sad actually. I feel kind of bad. Uh, since our evasion and luck is high, it's doing that. It's not even gonna like, kill you. That's so sad. Alexa, play Despacito. Uh, so 1.2 million health, so 13 hits. It really wants to kill Waka. Um... I believe it's regular attack, if it actually does hit you, can you do uh, sleep and delay. Uh, major delay, which is not fun. Uh, just trying to think. We should probably prepare. <laughs> we should probably prepare for its uh, thing over here, because I, I didn't save. Actually, Waka, can you get Yuna one turn in if you use haste on her? 
No. Okay, so you just use auto life on yourself as well, and let's hope for the best. I didn't save after after Ifrit, and that was stupid. Oh, it's not using its overdrive. Good. <laughs> Means we can summon somebody like Luca. <clears throat> I don't believe that Aerospark is um, any sort of, wow that's stupid I mean good I don't believe Aerospark is elemental oof sizable oof can you can you just use your stupid thing on him please no you just get used to Thundodge that's okay Oh no, Thundodge is not an elemental too, I forgot. Uh, so this might be bad. <laughs> but we'll see. Uh, it did use Aero Spark on Luka as opposed to our other characters, so we might still be okay. I'm just going to use Auto Life on Uni as well. Oh, it, used, uh, it didn't use Thor's Hammer, that's weird. All right. Oh, maybe it doesn't use it in this one. Uh, that's, that's maybe that's it. Okay. Now I'll just smack it a whole load again. Yeah, let's just Kirok at him so his attack goes back up. Um, but yeah, so this fight really uh, is a joke. Especially if your evasion and luck are high. Or, I was going to say if you have eat, uh, I don't want to do that again. If you have eater armor, but no, it's it's not elemental. At least they made it not elemental, so the, the fight wasn't a complete joke. But, yeah, he's dead. Uh, we get a Genji Omelette! Yay, that has ribbon on it, I think. Or at least break HP. Anyway, that man is now dead. Okay. Whoop! So, lightning and shadows strike the final blow upon the summoner that appears with the thunder's roar! So, interesting thing now. <laughs> Did we just get it immediately? We didn't. Okay. I was gonna say, did we just get it immediately? But no. Um, if... Uh, first of all, you can save now. There's actually a second fight with uh, Dark Ixion. And uh, you have to catch it in the lightning, which is kind of cool. Uh, that fight you'll also be able to run from, which is cool. Uh, you, omelets. Genji is break HP limit and lightning eater. So you know what? Let's give that to Kimari, because why not? He deserves it. If we have it anyway, hello! Uh, so Dark Ixion, fight 2, has the same amount of HP and everything else. Does not counter anymore. And you can evade its attacks, so it's arguably worse. <laughs> And if your characters are fast enough, I'm guessing you can just absolutely annihilate it. Uh, you can still run from it. Also, you can save in between, so if you want to farm off of this guy, by all means. So let's see what he does. Yeah. Isn't that sad? And if you have evade encounter, then this fight's kind of a, a joke. <clears throat> Whoops. Keep forgetting I have it on memory. Aerospark is not going to do much. It might kill me. Yeah, okay. But I believe he's going to die. Let's not do that again. Die this time around. Uh, you know what? Let's... Let's summon Luka again. I don't know why. I don't know why I did that. We'll shield and see if he uses Thor's hammer this time. There we go. I just wanted to see him use it. As far as I know, Thor's hammer is just P 
pure attack as opposed to statuses because I didn't write it down but I could be wrong it'd be hilarious if I just absorbed it nope it didn't kill me uh okay I just wanted to absorb the attack so thank you Luca Uh, yeah, I can't really do anything to, else to me right now. <laughs> it's so sad. Yay, you gonna get the last kill again. Last hit. Ah, oh, well. I would really like another armor. Uh, perhaps with ribbon on it, because ribbon is good. Arcane Ring. Uh, I might have gotten my wish granted. Let's see. And the music is back. Nope. Break HP limit. How much do you have? 22,000. Eh. Uh, I like her being a phoenix, though. I don't really like Lightning Eater on there, either. So I'm gonna give you that back. Uh, but yeah, that's those two. Uh, that's... We're only 11 minutes into the episode, so let's go move on to the next one, which... Um, is going to prove to be actually harder, don't worry. Uh, but the next Aeon that we got was Shiva. So going on from Thunder Plains to Lake Makalania. Hey, Makalania. Uh, let's just give this a save over here. I'm gonna... I like having Lulu out because she's fun. It, it's just fun to smack everybody with the uh, Onion Knight, but... Uh... I don't know. I feel like Riku... Uh, Riku also has uh, Auto Phoenix and uh, she's fun. Uh, I also have Orin as an Auto Phoenix because one of the bosses dropped Auto Phoenix uh, Bracer for him. So I have four characters now as Auto Phoenix, so that's cool. Um, yeah, to get to the, to Shiva, you have to go all the way back to Makalania Temple. Unfortunately, you don't have a snowmobile. Oh, there's a save over here. That's cool. I don't really care. At least it's a straight shot, but I liked, I liked the snowmobile scene, you know? It was fun. You're like, hey, that's, that's the, my favorite character. Lulu is still the one that throws Titus the ball with like all the Blitz Ace uh, animations. No one, no one surpassed her yet as the favorite. And yeah, we get to see this scene again, which is still really cool. Oh, look at all those people waiting for us. It's so nice. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Hello! How's everybody doing? Fool! You come back to Makalania Temple, a traitor! <laughs> traitor! Find your salvation on the far plane! Yeah, they tried to hide his voice, but that's, that's just, um... What's his face? The... Head of the Guado right now. Uh, anyway, Dark Shiva, 1.1 million health, yeah, less than Ixion and Ifrit. Uh, overkill of 99.999, drops Ice Strike and Eater um, weapons and armor. Also, break damage limit, break HP limit, ribbon, nothing else special there. Drops uh, Dark Matter or Master Sphere, and you can steal Mana Tab from it. Uh, now, Dark Shiva is interesting in that she has very high agility, so she's probably going to be getting a ton of attacks on you unless you're maxed out here. Um, in addition, uh, her Heavenly Strike attack uh, is Insta-Death, Berserk, and Confuse. So it's fun times all around. Uh, I'm actually going to change over here to using Quick Hit with everybody, which is going to make things go a little better. Uh, and since I have it on, yeah, since, since I have it on memory, it'll just make life a little easier there. Ooh, nice, nice kick there. 
So, I don't think that we're going to get... Yeah, we're not going to kill her before she gets her overdrive, I think. I can summon our Shiva anyway. Uh, oh, that's bad. Um, Riku. Riku, you want to use auto life? I should have had a mix ready. Uh, Diamond Dust is going to be bad. It might actually... No, Diamond Dust doesn't, doesn't destroy us, but it's gonna do a lot of damage as far as I remember. Like, a lot of damage. For some reason I thought I saw Yuna instead of Riku there. Ooh! <laughs> Thank god it doesn't dispel us. Uh, don't kill me. Good. Let's... Let's full life Yuni. Just that we have another person to revive, so in case either, well, whichever one of us is murdered right now. Or nobody, that's cool too. Oh, she got two hits in. <laughs> if you don't have Auto Phoenix, you're gonna have a really hard time with like most of these bosses anyway, because as you can see, Shiva is just getting in hit after hit. <laughs> oof, like a very sizable oof, you know? Uh, if I use Haystega, no, that will not help. Let's just get Waka back up so that we have a, a fuller team. Heavenly Strike. Instant Death. And again, if you if you don't... You see she was blinking for a second there. Uh, if you don't... If you have Death Proof, then it will just... Uh, <laughs> ah! If you have death proof, then it will uh, it will just give you berserk and and every and uh, confused, and that can be arguably worse. Uh. Ooh, ooh, getting uh, getting a little tricky there. Quick hit seems to have a little better attack, which is nice. Uh, no, I don't trust that you're not going to do full damage, just in case this is the killing blow, you know? Poor you. Uh... Okay, I don't trust that Waka's going to be able... I mean, Waka could just use, uh... You know, his other thing, you know, whatever, whatever it's called. Attack reels, there we go. We could use that and just end this, but I want to try not using attack reels if I don't have to. But she's probably going to use diamond dust now. Or next turn, I guess. Unless this kills you. Nope. Now we get to see the animation again. I just, I love the snap at the end, you know? And now here's the questions. The Dark Aeons look really cool, but do you like the original look or the, the other one better? Ow, 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 ow. Love it. Love it. Okay, Uni. Smack her upside the head. Oh. Uh. No, she's not gonna do that, so let's just. Let's quick hit. There we go. Beautiful. So, now that we've gotten rid of the four initial Aeons, it's not going to be easy anymore! Solidity! That sounds like Ice Eater. Wait, are they just going to keep... They're not going to keep summoning her, are they? Oh, thank god. <laughs> 
I thought for a second. I thought for a second that they were going to, like, keep doing that, but I did not have that down in my notes. But now we're going to do the same thing where we have to run away from these jerks. Or... Now, these are normal enemies. Like, remember the enemies that we fought here? These are normal enemies. Which means they have a normal amount of HP. <laughs> uh, one sec. Uh, I just want to see. We get the solidity for you. No. Uh, for you. Ribbon. Ooh, it has ribbon! An ice eater. Nice. Nice eater. Alright, so Orin, you are going to equip that. You are no longer a phoenix, but I might auto-phoenix the armor anyway. But yeah, what ribbon does, if you've never played a Final Fantasy game, ribbon just gives you um, immunity from every status ailment. So Orin is now awesome. Uh, let's, you know, let's just heal everybody up. I think they're just going to keep going. Like, you have to actually run away from them like we did last time. I think they are just going to keep going. Which is annoying. But we can also just keep using Ultima on them. It's probably faster to, you know, do regular attacks, but that's not fun. It's more fun to do this. It's called showing off. Uh, good times. Good times. And yeah, there was someone right there already anyway. Alright, now we'll just do regular attacks because this is taking a while. I like that it's it's kind of imitating you know, past events in the game, you know, just reminding you, hey, remember what happened last time you were here? <laughs> Although I don't think Sin is gonna come by this time around. It's too bad that no encounters doesn't do anything for them. Look how fa- oh my gosh, look at that guy rubber banding! Look at him rubber banding! You can actually see it! Also, we have, like, regular random encounters, which is rude. Since everybody's accuracy is, uh, is maxed out, these guys can be hit by anyone at this point. And... Oh wow, he actually got close enough to reach us, that's weird. Probably gonna get hit by this guy then before we leave. Look at that rubber banding. Goodness gracious. I just wanted to go through the Mak Makalani Poister to get whatever it is is in there. The jerks. You know, at the end, the faith, the Chamber of the Faith is the it's the only one we haven't seen yet. Or we haven't, uh, yeah, it's the only one we haven't seen yet. Alright, so that's that. I am going to... Well, let's walk back. And, uh... Was this music... Was this playing before? You know, before we fought the... Shiva? I don't know. Anyway, let's talk to everybody there, because the Guado are all gone. Hello! I'm hungry. No one's coming to pick me up. Oh. The Guado have left the temple, restoring peace to this holy place. It's a relief that those troubling folk are gone. Okay, so that, now that they'll let us back in, because apparently the Guado are the only reason why we were having trouble there. Yay, so I will meet you at the end, I guess. Those who once criticized the Albed are now blaming the Guado. Have they no shame? 
Before, both humans and Quato. Now, nobody comes. So, the High Priest of Makalania was Maester Seymour. A new High Priest has not yet been appointed in his place. Hmm. Ronzo will probably be singled out next. This woman knows all about <laughs> ethnic racism. Or ethnicism, I guess. Anyway, I'll meet you there. Because this is an annoying one. Unless it just lets me write all the way through. Please just let me all the way through. Right, this one this one is uh is the one that you have to find your way out. Right, okay, cool. Uh cool. That means we just get to go here and maybe it'll warp us out anyway. No! No, you stupid. Remember when we fought Maester Seymour here and killed him and then he didn't die? That was fun. I was wondering what this was. You could see this from like the upper path, you know? And you hear the, uh, the Hymn of the Faith here. Magic Sphere. And let's see, we also get Magic Defense Sphere. Definitely need one of those and an Accuracy Sphere. Okay. All three of those. Oh, the Magic Sphere is annoying to get because of the Jumbo Flan. What the heck? Don't scare me like that. Oh, it's an Amazon package. Um, but yeah, so that is going to do it for this episode. Next time things are going to get a little tougher because we're fighting Dark Bahamut. Oh boy. Um, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye. No, we have to do it. <laughs>